Yo, it's Grogu. Hi, how you doing? I'm doing pretty good. You know why? Because this is the first Pokemon Scarlet and Violet Wi-Fi battle on this channel. I am so excited. My opponent here, Killian, has a pretty cool team. Uh, they do have the Palafin. Um, you know, that's okay. Sure, it's banned from OU, but it's all right. Um, me, myself, uh, I'm bringing some cool Pokemon here. Uh, I'm, I'm really liking the new Pokemon. Uh, they're, they're all really, really good, I think. Um, but... I guess you'll see that here soon, so. So, opponent leads out with Palafin. I'm going to lead out with Ape Escape. I thought they were going to lead Glamora and get their hazards up, but I guess not. I guess they really, really want that transformation. That's fine. Okay. Um, so, I'm going to predict him to go for a nice flip turn. Uh, into what? Mm, not sure. Maybe, uh, maybe a Gold Dango. Uh, I'm, I'm predicting him to go out in the Gold Dingo, so we're going to go for a Rage Fist here. But he Terra's turn one. Water Terra's turn one. That is insane, okay? So we we already know what his Terra type is. That is completely fine. Let's see what movie goes for. So he does go for the, the flip turn like I predict here. Uh, let's see what he goes into. And obviously, no, that's not going to do too much to us. We are sort of like a bulky uh, Annihilate. Uh, and every time we get hit, you know, it, it just powers up our Rage Fist even more. So, let's see what he goes out into. Like I said, predicting a, uh, Gold Dango here, but let's see. So it goes out into the Tinkerton here. Wasn't predicting that, but it's going to take quite a bit from our Rage Fist here. Let's watch. As we go for this nice new... Oh, I love that animation. Mm. Does over half, okay, to Tinkerton. We get a little bit of HP recovery back with leftovers. Uh, and now I'm thinking, you know, I really don't want to take uh, Play Rough from this Pokemon. Because I, I guarantee that they are going to outspeed us. So I'm going to go into Don Amnesia. The nice big Don Dozo on a wear boy. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. He's going to go ahead and take this hit for us. Let's see what the ticket time goes for here. We go for the player, just like I thought. Don Amnesia takes that amazingly. A little bit of HP recovered back as well with that leftovers. And I am uh, max HP, max attack on this Don Dozo here. Uh, I'm looking at his team. I'm like, mm hmm. Nothing wants to take an Earthquake. So let's see what they uh, go into here if they do switch. Uh, if not, the Tinkaton is going to drop here. Like I said, this is max attack here. So let's see what they do. Okay. They withdraw the Tinkerton. All right. And they go into their Glamora. Okay, if it's not Air Balloon, it's dead. It is completely donezo. All right, it's not Air Balloon. It's gone. Goodbye. Four times effect, dude. Oh, Non-amnesia taking the first KO. I love it. He gets his toxic debris up. That's, you know, that's fine. It's fine. Uh, we got our own Glamora in the back to... Suck was up. It's completely fine. Getting some more HP recovery back here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And let's see what they go into next here. So they're going to go into Roaring Moon. Oh, boy. <laughs> he's going to have his booster energy. Okay. What is he? What is boost to? He's going to go for the attack boost. Okay. So he's not max speed, I guess. Right? Uh, I'm not sure. Anyway, so... I'm looking at his, his uh, thing here. It doesn't show on the actual stats, but that's all right. Um, I don't have anything that wants to take a hit from this thing, so I'm just going to stay in and go for a body press. As he goes for Outrage, almost KOs us. Okay. <laughs> Don Amnesia is built like a truck here. It has half HP, not even like defense invested at all on, on uh, Don Amnesia here. And he does over half to the Roaring Moon. Uh, I'm looking at my team like, mm, I kind of just have to sack this uh, this Don Amnesia here because I don't want anything else to take an Outrage. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to go and do a, a body press and just sack off our Don Amnesia as he goes for, you know, another Outrage. He's locked in. But is he locked in for two turns or three? Let's see here. He got the two turn. All right. So he's confused now. That's cool. What I'm going to go into next here is PV Piranha, our nice Glamora here. It's also going to suck up the Toxic Spikes when it comes in here. We got a shiny, a nice shiny PD as well. Mm, love that color. Um, 
I'm Focus Sash here, so, you know, it, it has to kill me, kill me in two moves. Uh, and, and let's see... Okay, so he goes for Earthquake. Obviously, we're going to live because of the Focus Sash. I'm going to get myself rocks up here. And, you know, Focus Sash pops. We're going to get our rocks up as well as our Toxic Spikes. Or, sorry, not rocks. I keep saying rocks. <laughs> spikes. We're going to get our spikes up. I have rocks on this uh, Glamora as well. But we're going to get our spikes up here. Um, because nothing wants to, you know, really switch into that. Onto the spikes here. I know it's not going to do too much, but that's all right. So here, I'm gonna go for the Memento, hoping that he gets confused. Let's watch, let's see. Gets confused, that is amazing. I'm able to get my Memento off so that his attack is lowered here. So this thing is a non-threat at this point. And with this, you know, PD's gonna go down here. But I'm gonna go back into our Ape Escape. Come on out, Ape Escape. Yep, yep, yep. And at this point, I'm just going to bulk up here. He's minus, I think, minus two attack, right? Um, or at least minus one. But anyway, if he stays in here, we're going to eat at least one or two hits. Um, and let's see what he does here. Is he going to stay and let me set up, or is he going to switch? Okay, so he withdraws Roaring Moon. That's cool. Let's see what he goes into. He's go is into the Chen Pao, Chen Po. I'm not sure how to say that. He gets the Sword of Ruin off. That's completely fine. We're gonna get our bulk up, as we see that he is heavy duty boots on this thing, so it's not taking any hazards. That's completely fine. And at this point, I'm pretty sure I can live one hit from this thing. Um, obviously, it's not Sash, so. Drain Punch should just be able to knock this thing out. Easy peasy. Let's see. He goes for the Taunt. Expecting me to bulk up yet again. Obviously, we're not going to. We're going to get this Drain Punch off. We're plus one. This is quad effective stab. It is gone. This thing, massive threat, gone. Amazing. Nice one shot. Get all of our HP back here. And what is he going to send into next? At, th at this point, um, I think Ape Escape kind of just like sweeps the rest of his team he finally goes into the goldango here if he's sash he's no longer sashed um i'm kind of scared of this thing this thing has a really really good attack or special attack so i'm gonna tear a water here and then rage it's that way so if he goes for shadow ball or whatever it's not gonna be super effective against us and we should just be able to knock this thing out um this is, you know, plus one. The Rage Fist, was, Rage Fist has been boosted, you know, quite a bit here. I don't think this thing will live. And we actually outspeed. I, I thought this thing would outspeed us, but it does not. That is kind of crazy. Okay. So we outspeed. I'm, I'm not, like, speed invested at all on this thing, too. I'm surprised about that. But we one-hit KO, just like I thought here. Let's see what he goes into next. Goes out into the Tinkerton. Let's see if this thing actually outspeeds us here. Let, let, let's see if I was worrying for for any reason here. But at this point, neither of his moves are going to be like super effective against us. So I'm just going to go for the Drain Punch here. And Ape Escape pretty much has us in the bag at this point. There's nothing uh, our opponent can do here. So he goes for the player. If he does outspeed us, so I, th I thought he would. Uh, obviously, you know, Drain Punch is going to knock this thing out. This thing is an absolute monster. <laughs> Man, I, I really love Annihilate. I love the, all the Pokemon in this, in this gen. I think my favorite so far is um, uh, Tatsugiri. I, I really like Tatsugiri. The Pokemon's awesome. But, yeah. So, okay. So, our taunt wears off. And at this point, like I said, we're, we're just sweeping. <laughs> we're getting an Ape Escape sweep. First battle ever sweeping. Mm -hmm. He goes back into the Roaring Moon here. This thing won't be able to KO us at all. Um, we're, I think, uh, like max HP and near max defense on this thing, I'm pretty sure. And we're plus one defense as well, so this thing shouldn't be able to knock us out here. He goes for the Outrage. Does about half. Like I said, does not knock us out. That's cool. We go for the Drain Punch here. You're going to get a little bit of HP back. It's not going to really matter too much. But, you know, health recovery is health recovery, right? Every hit we take, the stronger Rage Fist gets. And at this point, he's only got one Pokemon left. He's got the Palafin. I'm not sure why they brought it. Um, 
or, or I guess didn't use it. Like they brought it and didn't use it, right? They just terrorized it and, and left it in the back. Um, but at this point, it's not going to be able to KO me with anything. And he gets, you know, poisoned and spikes damage. So if he was a Focus Sash, which I doubt he was, but if he was, it's broken now. And we can just go for a boosted Rage Fist here to win the game. That was a <laughs> pretty cool battle. You guys didn't get to see the other three Pokemon on my team, but, that, you know, that's okay. Sometimes, you know, it, it, that, that stuff happens. But really enjoyed this battle here. Rage Fist KO. Mm. Terra Water, Terra Water. But, yeah. So if you guys like that, you know, obviously like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll be back with more battles later on. I appreciate you. Peace.